Dr. Paul, to you first. We have uh, the internet suspended. We have section 144 imposed in Howrah, two dead, 22 injured in Ranchi, homes demolished in UP, 200 people arrested, a second consecutive day of violence. What is it going to take for the centre to respond? Does more action need to be taken apart from a mere suspension? Dr. Paul. Is it you? Are, uh, are you asking me? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, this is Abdul here. Go and ahead, ma'am. Uh, the violence started uh, on the 8th, to be specific. And even today, the violence continued. It still continues. And uh, in the first day, we saw for 11 hours, people were stranded in the national highway. There were patients, there were women, there were children without water without food, and West Bengal police were silent spectators. Ma'am, the West Bengal yes. Chief Minister says the BJP sins and the public has to pay the price. As you're saying, women, children stuck out on the roads because of all of this unrest. See, I feel uh, Honorable Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee is instigating. Instead of telling the police and the administration to take strong steps, we have been seeing the police and the administration very, very silent spectators. Hmm. In front of them, we see hundreds and thousands of people burning down public property. BJP, uh, our offices have been burned down. But, pe but police haven't been taking any action. That's very, very strange. BJP hmm. has taken action on the, on the two person, on the spokesperson, whoever, who has said, you know, whatever she has said, I'm not getting into that. Hmm. But my question to Honorable Chief Minister is that when another TMC leader hmm. had uh, insulted our Lord Mahadev a few years back, what did she do to her? There were FIRs against her. What did she, what did she do to her? 